Good morning, and yes, you've won a fabulous eight-hour day chained to this machine.
This station is now the ultimate power in the universe. I suggest we use it. Don't be too proud of this technological terror you've constructed. Your scientists have yet to discover how neural networks create self-consciousness, let alone how the human brain processes two-dimensional retinal images into the three-dimensional phenomenon known as perception. Yet you somehow brazenly declare seeing is believing? I am the guardian of forever. Look, I'm sorry. Uh, I I didn't get your name. I got yours, uh, Vincent, right? But but I, I never got your name. My name's Pitt, and your ass ain't talking your way out of this shit. I just want you to know how... I just want you to know how sorry we are that, that things got so fucked up with us and, and Mr. Wallace. It, 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 we, we got into this thing with the best intentions, really. I never... Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? I didn't mean to do that. Please, continue. You were saying something about best intentions? What's the matter? Oh, you were finished. Oh, well, allow me to retort. You read the Bible, uh, Greg? Yes. Well, there's this passage I got memorized. It sort of fits this occasion. Ezekiel 25, 17. The path of the righteous man is beset on all sides by the inequities of the selfish and the tyranny of evil men. Blessed is he who in the name of charity and goodwill shepherds the weak through the valley of darkness, for he is truly his brother's keeper and the finder of lost children. And I will strike down upon thee with great vengeance and furious anger those who attempt to poison and destroy my brothers. And you will know my name is the Lord when I lay my vengeance upon thee. <laughs> Oh, my God.